In this episode, we found a new friend. Welcome to Back Here Bugs with Brody. All right, buddy. What do you have for us today? An American toad that looks like a different so, type. Hold on, we're, we're going <laughs> to talk about this in a second. All right, so this is a toad. Now, we know, we, we're pretty sure this is an American toad. And how do we know? There's a couple ways that we know that it's an American that toad. on its belly, there's a bunch of speckled dots. Okay, so let's talk about that first, so we can see. Okay, if you look from where I'm at, you can yeah, I'm kind trying of see. To, oh, well, you have to look keeps, from the front. He keeps moving. Because he's trying to look this way. Yeah, hold on. Well, because he doesn't want to. He doesn't want to. He's camera shy. Yeah. He keeps moving around. Yeah, yep, so you can see the speckled dots on his belly. We're trying to feed him What's right the now. other way that you... Um, like, no, that it's an American like a toad. blotch under its eye, I'm guessing. No, that yeah. was for the that was for the uh, tree frog. Um, what's on the, remember what's on their back, like right behind their eyes, the glands. Oh yeah. There's some glands that look in the shape of a kidney, behind their eyes, and then their warts that they have on their backs um, are usually circled in black. Um, and there's usually one or two warts per black spot. Yeah, but when I always look at the American toad, mm -hmm. by the warts, you can see a little bit of yellow for some reason. Yeah, sometimes there's yellow on there. But what did we think when like we first yellow. caught him? Because most of the time our... Um, Seek app is right. No, yeah, but yeah. most of the time our American toads, right, are what color? The, the dark Brown. They're like a dark brown. They can be almost a black, um, or sorry, they're like a dark brown or a light brown, right? Like a tan color almost. This guy, this guy has a lot of different colors, right? He's not really one solid color. He is kind of brown with black splotches, right? So what did we think when we first found him? What did we think it was? Um, a, I forgot its name. Begins with an F. Uh, Fowler's toad. A Fowler's toad. And we saw it in Illinois. We yep. saw, we saw like three types of toads in Illinois. Yep, we were in Illinois. You found all kinds. Of, you found three different types of toads in Illinois. And but, then we found. But we two thought. Three frogs. Yeah. And then, and then a uh, like little leopard frogs. Yeah. So we I thought we thought this was a Fowler's toad, and the Sea Cap even said it was a Fowler's toad. No, it said it was like a something. Past no, the. Oh. Fowler's said yes. So, oh yeah, it said it was a Woodhouse toad yeah. or something like that, which we knew wasn't right. Um, but Google told us either American toad or Fowler's toad, but even Google's uh, photo image search didn't even know. So we had to look it up and and really take a look at it and see. And based off of the description, we're, we're pretty sure this is an American toad. Now we could be wrong, but we're pretty sure it's an American toad. There's a butterfly. There's a butterfly where? Uh, oh, on, on the mom's thing. plant. It's, yeah. It's a small, like, brown one. You can see it moving. What up. type of plants are these? Uh, They're called... Cup. cup begins with a C. Plant. Cup plants. Yep, and they're flowering right now. It's, let me tell you where... We've got all kinds... Yeah, they, they, I, they can see it. Okay. There's a... Oh, there's a butterfly right on that flower right there. It's kind of hard to see. Yeah, it and then... We have a lot of bees. We've got honeybees and bumblebees. We got carpenter bees. Yeah, there's carpenter bees around. There's a bee right there. There's some other bees on the other side. We have some bees, but we haven't really seen them. Yeah. They are laying their eggs in our bee nest thing. Okay. So we we tried. What did we try to do with this guy? Um, we tried to feed him. We did try to feed him. He is not, um, was not cooperating. He wouldn't eat while we were on camera. Because he didn't want to. Yeah, he's, well, we're around and he just wants to get out. Yeah. Now, we did find that he, what, when did he eat? When we put him in the dark. 
Yeah, so we had them. Um, Are they nocturnal? Well, yeah, they're not toads. We'll hunt at night. Why do you think you found them all at night? Remember in yeah. Springfield, you found them all at night? Yeah, I found like birds. They come out when the bugs are out. I yeah. found like, yeah, I found, I, I found the same toad every day. Yeah. Uh, at, at daytime, it was just under this rock. Yep. I just checked it every day. So, well, excuse me, we'll let him go. Mm -hmm. It's, <clears throat> it's morning time. I'm not fully awake yet. Um, so we're going to let him go mm -hmm. where you found him. Um, we put a couple mealworms in there, but he does not seem to be too interested in them. Yeah. He just wants to get out of the cage, so we're going to let him out of the cage, okay? Mm -hmm. well, see, maybe he'll turn and he'll be interested. Yeah, probably, you know, like I said, he ate earlier, so he probably is not going to be too hungry right now. All right, do you want to go let him go? Yeah. Okay, let's go let him go where you got him from. Found him, not gone. I didn't take him from the pet store. <laughs> Ryan found him. And then while we're over here, you can show him what else you found over here before. Over here? Yeah, remember under that rock? Oh, those. Yeah. Ouch, just stepped on a rock. Should I show them what's under there or let this guy go first? Let's let this guy go first. Okay. Where did you find this guy? Under this rock. Okay, leave the rock where it is. Just put him at the entrance of the underneath the rock. I'm gonna put him right here. That's, that's fine. He'll dotted. just face him in. He'll go crawl under the rock. It shouldn't be a problem. Is this the rock where the stuff was under? Was oh, he hopped out. Oh, it's fine. Just oh, let him be. That, now he'll he'll hop. He'll find his way in. Actually, Don't get eaten by the owls. Well, the owls. I'm more worried about the snakes, man. Do you want to you want to put him underneath the rock real fast? Mm -hmm. Oh well, let him go if he's gonna. If he gets too far back there, just let him be. He'll find a hiding spot. I got him. All right, just turn him around. Yeah, there you go. go. There, just let him be. Okay, now show me where. What was which rock was it? This one. Wait, the one you just put him under? Yeah. That's where the stuff was. Yeah. Well, why did we put him under there if you're gonna flip the rock over to look under it? I thought she said it was under this rock. No, I said it was under that rock. All right. Oh, you might be able to see if you... Oh, yep, he's already just sitting there waiting for food to come by. All right, so let's just let him be. Yeah. What was... Just tell everybody what was under there. A turtle egg. We think there were turtle eggs under there, right? It only was... It was either a turtle egg or bird egg. Or maybe snake egg. Mm. But snake eggs are usually, like... Are usually, like, an oval. Yeah. I think it was either a bird egg or a snake egg. Now, Except we know, for python eggs. Yeah, we know that bird eggs don't birds don't lay their eggs under a rock. So if it was a bird egg, how do you think the bird egg got under there? Snake. A snake might have, because it was just the shells, right? But my guess is it was a turtle egg. Yeah. Um, because we do have baby turtles on this side of the yard. So. All right. Well, it was weird because it was just one egg. <laughs> right. It was just one random egg. That we know of. I mean, there. I guess so maybe there could be the, more. the it laid an egg, and then the snake like found it, and then brought it under there, and then cracked it open. Uh, well, snakes don't crack eggs open. Well, they, they eat them whole. Well, they eat. <clears throat> I feel like they eat them whole, and then they spit out the shell because I don't think they like the shell. Uh, you'd have to look that up. That sounds like I'll, you're I'll just speculating. Up. You'd have to look it up. All right. What do you want to say to everybody? Thanks for watching. Make everyday adventure. Bye, guys.